Retro Unboxing. Hello viewers, welcome back to the channel. This is my 60 quid iMac video that I've actually edited completely on said 60 quid iMac. Uh, whilst this is editing, there's also a screen record of the entire edit process going on uh, with QuickTime uh, screen recording. Um, this is actually working really, really well. Uh, currently, my, my daily is an M1 um, Mac uh, Studio, and obviously that is much faster and a, a lot snappier, but this is still incredibly usable. And uh, you can see what I'm doing here is just putting the uh, last bits of sticky tape on, the old uh, double-sided sticky tape, so I can stick the screen back onto the uh, the 60 quid iMac. Uh, what I'm actually doing here is just stuffing my jumper up the back there so that uh, the screen doesn't keep tilting back while I'm trying to put the screen on. But uh, anyway, so I've got the uh, screen back on, got the cables back connected. Uh, I did plug it in very quickly just to double check that the cables are connected um, correctly and that the screen powers on properly before I actually uh, stick the screen down. Uh, you can still see there's a couple of tabs there uh, and I'm just about to pull them off. So uh, that's it. The screen's stuck back on, uh, giving the Mac one last wipe down, <laughs> and uh, and then and then it's complete. And uh, oh, one thing I did do just to try another method, uh, see if I could do anything with the scratches on the front, uh, was to just use a bit of car polish. Um, but as I'd said in in probably part one and part two, those scratches are just in the um, are in the coating, so there's an anti-glare coating on these screens, and uh, just there's just not a lot you can do about it, to be honest. So the scratches are still there. I think the polish may have have just pulled off a few of the rough edges, um, and uh, so you know I'm looking at the screen now. The camera is pointing at the screen now. I'm, I'm using it. There's a couple of big scratches on there, but generally, and even genuinely, um, you can't really see them. It's uh, it's it's really surprising. Uh, you genuinely cannot see the scratches as you're using the computer. It's amazing, really. But as you can see, the stand is fixed. Uh, everything is all looking far sexier than it was when I first picked it up. Uh, it's a lovely little machine. And for 60 quid, you too can have an iMac. And uh, one that's very, very usable. Here you can see I've just done a couple of uh, little, I've just chucked a load of little transitions in. I've chucked a couple of um, little things over the uh, video just to, just to test out how long it's going to take to, uh, to do. But uh, anyway, thanks very much for watching and hopefully I'll see you on the next one. Retro Unboxing.